twinkle twinkle little star how i wonder what you are up above the world so high like the diamond in the sky hello and welcome to my channel thank you so much for joining me on my program once again i appreciate you wherever you are connecting from if you are joining me from africa from asia from europe from america or from australia i thank you very much for your contribution on my channel please always go to the comment section make your comment if you have not subscribed kindly subscribe and click the notification button so you'll be notified each time there's a video Today, I want to share with you another video. As you all know, I share information on things that are going on in Nigeria, wherever it's happened, whenever it's happened, I bring it to your doorstep. And today, I am going to talk about the situation of Nigeria. You know about the raid on Sunday Bo's house, which I did report in my channel. If you have not watched the video, you can go and watch the video down there. I talked about the raid and I, I brought the video on the raid on Sunday Bo's house. And there was silence, but all of a sudden, the DSS have come to make an open speech on the arrest of uh, people from the home of uh, uh, Sunday Bo. As usual, you know, the Nigerian SS with their lies and all what now, they come out to parade people that they arrested in the home of uh, Sunday Bo, showing off a whole lot of weapons and ammunition that they claim to have collected from them and all manner of lies. But from every indication, what they are saying does not hold water. It doesn't hold water. It doesn't hold water. It doesn't seem like true. The lie is obviously clear. If these people have such kind of ammunition and AK-47 fighting back against the military, I think there will be more casualties and a lot of people will be lying down dead. But as usual, they always come to lie to make sure they give the dog a bad name in order to kill it. Now let us watch the press interview that the SSS gave and they have also given a warrant arrest on Sunday Igbo. So let's see and know uh, how it's going to unfold and what is going to happen in time to come. But it's not going to be well. It's not going to be well. I'm telling you. Let's watch what they had to say. The gun duel, which lasted for an hour, on five people, the chance. Escape. Sunday Sunday and their Sunday Bobo is now on the run. Ibo may run as far as he can. He may hide as long as he wants. He might have attacked security operatives as he still carried him. But this will be the end of the uh, uh, Soon, he will not have a hiding place. His strength will short fail him, and the law will catch up with him. The law will be slow, but indeed, it should be safe. Consequently, Deyamo, or Ibo, is advised to turn himself into the nearest security agency. Those cheering and eulogizing him may appeal to or advise him to do the needful. He should surrender himself to the appropriate authorities. He, or anyone for that matter, can never be above the law. Meanwhile, those arrested will be charged accordingly. I Enter into the compound before, and there was blasting everywhere. Expended bullets were also very many on the premises, and sympathizers are outside the house. Some of the neighbors, but no, nobody is willing to talk about the incident. Some of his aides know I like that. And insiders must have given those who came the information.
to carry out the operation because some of them are said to be asking specifically for some of his aids. They said that his wife was taken away, but I couldn't get the name of the wife from those people that spoke then. The area is tense now. Some of his aides do not allow journalists to enter into the premises any longer. Some of the aides were seen inside crying that their colleagues were killed just like that. They said one of those killed was an affair, that he was praying when he was shot dead. Thank you.